I've also tried to include products that in general have a lot of shades so if you're not my shade also you're fairer than me lighter than me darker than me whatever your skin tone you might be able to find a foundation shade or a concealer or powder shade for you hi what's up you guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to another makeup video after so long i know you all have been waiting for me to make makeup tutorials again and to make makeup recommendation videos again in my due defense i was making makeup videos i was just not posting them in long form content i was posting more on youtube shorts and reels on instagram and stuff like that because i genuinely feel like people are not watching buying makeup anymore after the pandemic but we are back the pandemic is nearing its end hopefully inshallah and we'll be soon glamming up traveling so much and wearing makeup to all these weddings that are going to come on and the key to a good makeup look has to be a good base your base has to look flawless and i know as brown skin girls we do face a lot of problem to pick our right shade the right coverage of concealer the right texture of powder and all of that with the diverse indian climate and also the diverse variety of indian skin tones i going to give you some recommendations of some of the best formula of foundation concealers and powders and also my shades in them so if you're anything close to my shade you will be able to find yourself a perfect match in the market so if you're interested then continue watching but if this is the first time you've come onto my channel then hi i'm sara i make beauty and lifestyle content here on youtube take a moment hit that subscribe button join the sara squad i'm sure you'll have a great time here and also don't forget to hit the bell icon right next to it so that every time i upload a video you get notified and with that let's dive straight into this first things first if you want to know how i got this makeup look i will be uploading it on youtube shorts so stay tuned for that additionally if you want to learn in depth from me on how to do your base makeup how to get every single step in your makeup routine to perfection then you should check out this playlist right here i have a complete beginner's guide on every single step of the makeup routine nicely broken down for you all so you can definitely check it out the first category has to be foundations now when it comes to foundations i like something that's full coverage especially for the wedding season so i have three options for you actually four options for you which will cater to every single type of person agar aapko light coverage foundation pasand hai to wo bhi aapko mil jayega full coverage pasand hai to wo bhi mil jayega and i'm also making sure that i am giving you suggestions from all price categories so you can pick your affordable or your expensive jo bhi aapko khareedna hai wo aapki complete marzi hai the first foundation i want to share with you all has to be the maybelline fit me foundation i think this foundation is bomb for every single skin type previously like five to six years back I should not like the formula on the fit me when I had first tried it. Now, मुझे उसका texture नहीं अच्छा लगता था. It used to emphasize my acne and everything, but they have reformulated a couple of times after that. And now the formula on the Maybelline Fit Me foundation is banger. It's perfect. It's spot on. There are so many shades also available for different skin tones. I use the shade three thirty toffee. Kid you not, I have three bottles of the Maybelline Fit Me foundation in all different packaging. That's how much I love it. And every time, this is like my mixer foundation. With every foundation, I try to make sure that I make this a little bit because the texture of this is semi matte it's not completely matte finished but it's also not very dewy so it gives you that nice hydration and glow and good coverage as well you can use it completely by itself you don't have to want to mix this with anything but i love 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 mixing this with all my foundations and this is my go to that's why i have three of them so highly highly recommend this is also a super affordable foundation if i'm not wrong it's 550 rupees and there's a smaller mini sample version also of this somewhere around 300 The next foundation, a little steeper, but definitely worth your complete investment, has to be the Mac Studio Fix Fluid Foundation. This is OG, you guys. ये मेरा पहला foundation है जो मैंने कभी भी खरीदा होगा. अगर आपकी skin पे बहुत ज़्यादा acne है, तो this is a very good skin friendly foundation. आपके acne को irritate नहीं करता and also it covers it really really nicely. The texture of the foundation is nice, fluid. It blends really really easily, very well. Gives you full on coverage. It's not a medium coverage. at all very very full coverage in the mac studio fix i am an nc 43.5 but it is slightly cool toned for me so i prefer mixing it with a warmer undertone foundation it used to be just right for me but now staying indoors i've like lost my tan a little bit which is why it's now slightly cool toned for me looks a little ashy but nc 43.5 is my og shade like agar main bahar jaane lagi wapas tan hone lagi to ye mujhe perfectly suit karega ye foundation wo shaadi wala foundation you know it's like a special thing you 
should make sure to invest in this use it on all your weddings all your special occasions it's going to give you the flawless base and it also photographs really well the max studio fix fluid does not oxidize the maybelline fit me does oxidize a little bit uska ye matlab hai ki wo thoda sa dark ho jata hai ek baar blend kar liya but the max studio fix fluid does not oxidize at all it stays true to color so it stays exactly the same shade even after you've blended it into your skin the third foundation recommendation i have is a new b in my collection but ever since i got it i've used literally the complete tube this is the color bar weightless matte foundation it's 24 hour long wear what you get in this tube is just 25 ml of product for about 800 rupees so you might think it's cheap but it actually isn't because you're getting very little product i don't really like the packaging also of this because it's a squeezy tube with a pump on it to kafi matlab aadha time to hawa hi nikal rahi hoti hai isme se but this is a very 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 good formulation for an everyday basis like just on the run going to the mall going to meet your friends that kind of foundation that you want on your skin to give you a very light base like barely anything on your skin but also covers really really well because if you have acne marks and all it has good pigmentation it will cover everything while not feeling heavy cakey none of that blend is super easy you don't even need your blender you can just like you know take a little bit on your fingers and apply it like it's sort of like a bb cream foundation somewhere in between but more on the foundation side definitely stays on for really long as well i have the shade 8.1 and it suits me banger fw 8.1 is my shade it suits me perfect don't have to mix this with anything else unless i want to build my coverage then i can mix it with a little bit of the full coverage foundation and go for a heavier base makeup but if you're like a girl who doesn't like Like too much foundation going on should definitely try this out last but not the least i have the elf satin matte foundation it's the foundation i'm wearing on my skin right now i love the finish on this it's super like exactly what the name says it's satin matte it sets completely matte but gives a very nice glow healthy looking skin it's medium coverage it's sheer to medium coverage you can build this coverage up if you take too much product then it can be full coverage pigment on this foundation is super strong and nice it's also photographing really well so you can wear it for good occasions but you can also wear it on a everyday basis this is also not very expensive i think it's 800 rupees the next step is concealer for concealer my recommendations are going to be very medium coverage concealers because when i use a concealer i go to highlight my face like this definition that you see is because of concealer the first concealer recommendation has to be the la girl pro conceal hd this is a very 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 good concealer i love this so many people on the market love 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 this the applicator on this is a little irritating this squeezy thing that they have this pokey pokey thing itna acche se lag nahi pata iski wajah se but the formula in itself is so good so 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 good it's also creaseless like once you apply it it won't crease immediately you can take your time to set it with powder i use the shade medium beige and it really highlights my face very well it suits my undertone really really nicely this concealer is medium coverage but you can build it and use more product to get full coverage but i always believe like less is more less product definitely goes a long way with this concealer the next concealer has to be one that i have been using non stop in all my tutorials you will see me use this and this is the pack take cover concealer even off camera i continuously reach out for this this is in the shade birthday suit i really like the applicator on this as well it's a squeezy tube but it has a doe foot applicator really like that about it pack makes some great concealers i really like the spotlight concealer as well but that's full full coverage this is like a medium coverage that you can build up really applies well blends really easily does not crease at at all again i love 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 the formulation on this one as well and lastly the concealer i have for you is the wet and wild photo focus concealer the shade i use in this is medium deep tan and this concealer is also amazing it's medium to buildable coverage all of these three actually have very identical formula again comes with a doe foot applicator super easy to apply blends really easily does not crease is super affordable also you don't get a lot of shades in the wet and wild one so you might have some difficulty to pick it out the la girl and pack take cover both have a lot of shades for you to select from this is a little stingy with the shades i don't believe in spending too much on my concealers because i run out of them quite easily so all three of these are under 500 but i love all three of them equally and i would wear them all to weddings functions and for my daily use equally because i think they just suit the bill every single place now lastly for powders to set your makeup in place you need to apply powder otherwise it's going to be creasing all over you're going to be sweating all over especially if you're oily skin like me you're going to be 
just sweaty mess. You can fry pakoras on my face. That's how much oil I can secrete. So powder is very, very, very important for me. And I prefer using loose powder over compact powder. Compact powder is like an on the go thing. You know, you can just put it in your purse and touch it up when you're on the go outside at a function, at an event. But when I'm setting my concealer in place, in the first place, I like to go ahead with loose powder. The first loose powder I love is the Laura Mercier loose powder. I'm not going to speak too much about this because this is not available in India but this is amazing like if you're traveling abroad if you have relatives over there kisi se bhi mangwana hai matlab kisi se bhi kuch ek cheez mangwani ho na US Dubai kahin se bhi to ye powder mangao because it is really that good jo mera pehla international makeup haul tha na usme maine ye khareeda tha aaj tak chal raha hai itni quantity ye powder mein i'm pretty sure it's expired but i'm not going to stop using it cuz i love it and there's so much products still left it's the translucent loose powder so suits every single skin tone like even when i'm doing other people's makeup this is the powder i use it's very finely milled it applies like a dream it sets your makeup in place and it will make your makeup last really long not make you sweat and also doesn't give you flashback so when you take flash photography it's not going to give you any like white under eyes or make you look like a ghost that's like my worst nightmare come to life and since it's international very very expensive also a very very good dupe you have in the indian market today is the k beauty loose powder this loose powder is very good k by katrina really nailed it with this powder it's the hd setting loose powder and i use the shade latte there are a lot of shades in this again this shade is perfect to highlight my under eyes highlight this part of my jaw and make an add definition to my face sets makeup again really well very very finely milled and you get a lot of product in this powder also i love the packaging love the sieve net thing that they have going on this powder is a very close due to the laura mercier one it's 800 something and i think powders are a good investment to make cuz kaafi din tak chalte hai matlab mere to saalo saal se powder chal raha hai and even though i don't have so many i continuously keep using this i can still continue to use them so 800 900 for a powder is not bad but if you want something even more cheap then the mars banana powder is really good mars cosmetics makes some great makeup in the really really affordable category and i also have a code with them which is code sara10 so you get an additional 10% discount on their website this is the banana powder love this it's not too drying also usually banana powders are very very drying or fir ekdam zyada under eyes sookhi hui lagti hai aur jaldi crease hone lagti hai but ye aisa nahi hai you can bake with this keep it on for about you know 2 minutes 3 minutes and then dust it off flawless flawless finish no flashback whatsoever looks really good suits across skin types because it's a banana powder so if you have warm undertone it will suit you and it's again very finely milled and super super affordable so that completes it that's all my base makeup essentials these products are legit tried tested by me and make my base look flawless in every single one of my videos i trust these products with my skin and my base makeup so i highly recommend that you all can try this out as well i will make sure to leave whatever link I can find for y'all in the description, as well as there's this new feature on YouTube wherein there's a product section, so you can tap on that and just you know go ahead and see whatever product recommendations are there. So that's super cool as well. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you did, then don't forget to give it a big thumbs up because that really helps and will motivate me to make more makeup content for y'all. For today's video, Sarah's first shout out goes to the Dusky Pono. Thank you so much for watching and supporting my channel. If you want to be a part of next video, Sarah's first shout out, you know what to do. Hit that. subscribe button bell icon like, right next to it and also leave a comment down below saying hashtag sara squad and you get a chance to be a part of my next video sara squad shout out i will see you guys very soon in another video bye guys love you Mwah.